Okay, we're under the uh, 08 uh, Chrysler Town & Country here. We got our ABS sensor back probed, and we got a low amp, low amp probe around one of the around the uh, ABS voltage supply wire. Our yellow lead is in the uh, supply uh, supply wire going to the ABS sensor, and the green lead is in the uh, vehicle speed sensor return wire, which is actually a ground wire. But anyways, we'll get more of that later. And anyway, we got the scope set up here. Our channel one is set up on a 20 volt scale. Channel two is set up, I believe, on a two volt scale right now. And channel three is uh, our low amp probe, and we're on a uh, 500 milliamp scale with that. So first of all, uh, we'll spin the tire here and see what happens. Oh, we'll spin her here in the right direction. And we can see that there is some a small amount of amperage, maybe oh I don't know five milliamps, something like that maybe. And we got a small amount of voltage too, about half a volt of variation in our supply wire. But as you notice, the green wire, the vehicle supply or the vehicle speed sensor signal wire, which is which is the way it's marked, actually stays right at zero. It doesn't move at all. And just to verify that we do actually have a good contact in there on our uh, take the low amp probe off, that we do actually that our back probe is in there, and we do actually have a good uh, good contact. I'm going to pull the green test lead out here and just leave the back probe in there, and then I got. Uh, my vantage here and you could probably hear it click in there and we can see that we got 0.4 ohms resistance to ground on our uh, vehicle speed sensor signal wire again everything here is working normal this is a brand new speed sensor the point of the video is to show that it doesn't really work, work the way everybody seems to be claiming it works that you're supposed to get a, a small amount of voltage variation or speed sensor signal or variation when you spin the tire on the WSS t uh, wire. Actually the variation is on the, is on the voltage supply wire. And I should mention too that the key is on on the vehicle. I'm grounded. I got my ground lead actually got an extension on it going all the way up to the driver's door striker. So on the, on the pictures I posted on the product form the, the wave signal was looking kind of fuzzy and I think that probably was because I had a rusty ground connection back here and I should also mention that I got the filters on on both uh, um, well actually on all three channels I got filters on the uh, turned on on each channel so we'll go back here just connect the, the vantage we got our uh, probes hooked back up our probes aren't touching each other we got they're far enough far away from each other and we'll spin the tire here once again to show you that it's about a half a volt variation signal when the tire is spun we're on uh, what are we on? We're, on we're on a one second time sweep here and you can see there's a small amount of amperage too very very little it doesn't doesn't show up quite as much give her a good spin there and uh, that's that's how the speed signal is measured it or that's how the ABS module has seen that speed speed signal is on the voltage supply wire so I guess that's about it I just wanted to make a video here to show you what was uh, what I was doing and how I was testing it I had the car in the hoist the first time my hoist is uh, occupied right now so I'm just doing this on the floor here uh, it doesn't matter really if you, which direction you spin the tire the signal is the same so I guess that's about it for this video uh, just uh, showing the how to test one of these ABS sensors these are brand new ABS sensors and they are working functionally they are I should say they are both functional uh, the ones that were in here were uh, were actually measuring I did a just uh, measure the resistance on here here just uh, as a check when I was changing them the old sensors were right around one mega ohm. These here are the new sensors are up in uh, probably six to seven mega ohm 
range when you just check the resistance through the sensor with the uh, ABS module unplugged. So I don't know if that's a, if that's a uh, verifiable way of measuring them with the resistance test, but I think this here pretty much proves it though that uh, your signal is going to be on uh, it's going to be on your voltage wire. So I guess that's about it.